Uh, ooh, that. Hello, friends. Hello. Hey, buddy. Kitty. Hey, kitty. Hello. Hi. Hi. Hello. Kitty, where are you going? What shall we call you, Bruce? Are you a Bruce? You seem kind of like a Bruce. Hello, friends. Welcome to Hume DIY. I am outside. Say hi. Say hi. Me? Yeah, you. Hey. <laughs> Today we're doing yeah. some random stuff. Like Christy's gonna help me put out a uh, cover. Shade. Shade. In a little bit. And they're also finishing the slat wall. <laughs> Video to come out soon. <laughs> And then we also got a cat that might be named Bruce, but maybe not. It's also really hot out here. In the good Texas heat. But we're gonna putting up the shade, and then I think I might do some light uh, work in the garage to put these lights on this corner. There's a light here, and then there's a light out front that are always on if the breaker's on in the garage. So I'm gonna change that out to put them on switches so that we can turn the lights off while keeping the electricity on for the rest of the garage. Um, so we can use the garage doors and the plugs and the outlets and stuff like that. So I'm gonna be doing that and just house stuff in general. So yeah. Here, take a look at cute buddy. Hi cutie. Say hi. Say dada. But say dada. Jumping into the garage now, I need to figure out where the wires go because it's kind of a mess here and someone else did this, I didn't. But I figured it out and then I start cutting open a hole in the wall for the light switch. Now you should get a remodel box so you don't have to be a dumb dumb like me. It's like crazy hot out here. We got some Romex for the new outlet right there. The goal is to uh, connect that up. This is my first time working with Romex and I suggest getting a fish wire to make this easier. Um, and if you know anything about electricity, you can see what I'm doing wrong here. You'll find out in a second, but if you know, comment it. But here's some look at the electrical boxes that are just a complete mess. Alrighty, let's test it. Ooh. All right, nothing exploded. The light is off, so let's go check outside. Still on. This one is still on too, okay. Ooh, that. So I just popped the switch after I turned it on. So something is not correct. Let me figure out what that is. Summertime. Meanwhile, Chris and I are setting up this rectangular canvas tarp that I picked up from Home Depot. We put it in a triangle because we don't have a post on the other side and I thought it just looked pretty good. Overall, the price is good and it works great. We're happy with it. Hello there. Electricity, I'm a noob, kind of. I'm a noob for sure. Uh, but I totally forgot how to wire a switch. And so I only have one Romex cable going from the switch to um, the connector for these other lights, which is a neck because you need two Romex cables coming in and out of each light switch. So I'm gonna have to go back to the store, get some more Romex, and then figure out how to wire the switch again. So maybe tomorrow, maybe another day, but we'll see you out there. Hello everyone, welcome back. It's been a while. I've traveled, I've gotten sick, I'm still a little sick, but we're back to the garage. Hello kitty. 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 Anyways, kitty is good. Sorry for the interruption folks, editor Chris here, and unfortunately, Bruce the cat has passed away. And I'm kind of smiling because it was randomly, it was all of a sudden and we got this kitten from a friend and we were worried about all the stuff, uh, wild animals and stuff out where we live. Um, but we're unsure how he died, but it is super unfortunate. We were super sad and we only had him for a couple weeks, but yeah, he won't be showing up in any more videos, but you can enjoy these pictures. 
uh, that Kristen captured. Oh, you're looking just as good as I remember. I am, aren't I? Uh, mirror check, God damn it, I'm fresh. Looking like the human R.I.P. Bruce. We'll see you in Kitty Heaven someday. Alrighty, back to the video. I figured out the problem, and I have a solution already. So, let's get it. The solution here was to add another Romex cable from the electrical box to the light switch. But I also added another light switch for the light on the front of the garage. So I added two more Romex cables to be able to do that. All right, it's officially put together. Now, I haven't, oh, I haven't turned the power on yet. Um, but let me see, let me show you what I got. We got these two new light switches. One of them goes up, goes down there, which is, which is that one. We got this light switch goes up, connects to here, which goes down to this light on the outside of the thing. And then the power also comes down into here, uh, on the bottom here, and then on the bottom here to power both of them. So theoretically, I think I'm good, but this is try number three, I guess. Lights come on. These lights should be off. Yep. Yep. On. Perfect. And with that, I have both light switches working and all the outlets and the rest of the stuff working as it was before. So no problems. We did it. We accomplished it. No one died. Well, anyway, thank you all so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And hit that like, hit that subscribe and follow me for more videos, home DIY videos like this. Once again, RIP to our cat and I will see y'all out there.